Well, Mac, to connect the telephone line to the computer, you have to use one of two things, either an acoustic coupler or a modem. This is quite a nice acoustic coupler. It enables you just to take the telephone handset and plug it in like that, and in that way to get a very simple connection between the telephone and the micro. The nice part about it is, of course, it can be with a little portable micro like this. The whole thing can be portable. It's battery driven. And uh, I was using one of these in, uh, in New York when I was over there with the BBC. So I could go to a local phone, uh, put in 10 cents, dial a local number. It would get me through through a satellite into the UK, into British Telecom Gold. And I'd already typed into the micro some messages I wanted to send. I'd shoot them through. And at any time of the day or night, I could do it. And then, of course, I could read the replies as they came through. It's a nice little system. Yeah, it, it, it's very useful. Right, let's Let's try going in now, uh, dialing the telephone, using this modem here and getting straight in. So we dial 9 for an outside line and then 8372844 and we'll see if that will ring out. I have a nasty feeling, Mac, that we're going to have a few problems this morning, um, partially because I think we're going to have an awful lot of lines busy and I don't know whether we'll get through on this number. It's ringing. We'll see. Uh, and it's still ringing. And if a hundred other people are also trying to ring in, we may not get in on this line. <laughs> <laughs> but if not, we'll go around a different way. Right, not going to get in that way, so I'm going to have to go in, I'm afraid, through a uh, packet switch system. Um, sorry about that. 907536131. Now, would you explain what a packet switch system is? and what? <laughs> <laughs> well, all right, it's just another route going through another network, and unfortunately it's a little more difficult to go in this way, and we'd hoped we'd be able to get in the direct way but it's another route through a national network into this London computer. I just hope fewer people are going that way. Right, that's whistling. And let's now wake up the uh, packet switch exchange, please. And come on, reply to me. Ah, thank God for that. Right, and now it wants to know who I am. So this is the uh, code to get in here. TL, type that wrong, gold M. And it didn't take, because I'd made a typing mistake. And I do hope the cameras aren't on the keyboard too well there. Right, and it now wants to know the address of the computer that we want to get through. Well, I'll try and get to the one we were getting to. 219-201-004. That was a secret little piece of code you put in there. That, right. Uh... Now, now, we are now at last through to this London computer, and that was where I was trying to get through by direct dialing. Right. British Telecom Gold, we're through. We now have to type in our identification, which we said our ID was OWL001. And the machine asks what our password is, so no cameras on the keyboard, please. The password is that. And Telecom Gold, Automated Office Services, we're through. Mail call... Ah, <laughs> computer security error. I think Illegal we access. have some hackers. I think you've tempted some hackers <laughs> rather too well. Uh, Illegal access. I hope your television program runs as smoothly as my program worked out your passwords. Nothing is secure. Hacker song. Put Fine. another password in, <laughs> bomb it out and try again. Try to get past logging in. We're hacking, hacking, hacking. <laughs> That's brilliant. Try right. his first wife's maiden name. This is more than just a game. It's real fun, but just the same. It's hacking, 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 yes. Yeah, well, oh, no, no. ACN019, hi there, Alex, from Oz and Yug. Now, look, Oz and Yug, just go away, will you? We want to do a demonstration here. Go away. Um, right, now, if they've left this system anything like intact, we should be able to do a mail scan.